Dragon Head is a very interesting series, and it actually got um, it actually got published in America, I think, and it's also got a real life movie after it. Not real life, like it actually happened, but you know, it's got a real, you know, yeah. Um, Dragon Head, though, is a story. It's hard to explain because the reader doesn't even really know. But okay, let's just put it this way. Um, to avoid spoilers, I'll just see what happens in the first chapter or two, is that it's about a bunch of teenagers, they're on a school trip in Japan, and uh, they're riding the train, and all of a sudden a huge earthquake happens and the train is knocked underground. And once it's knocked underground, the kids, obviously some of them died, etc., and stuff like that, have to get out, and they have to find their way back up to the surface and figure out what the fuck's went on. When they get up to the surface, they see that pretty much everything is gone that the entirety of Japan has just been fucking annihilated and is just gg like, fucking the end. And so the rest of the series is figuring out what the fuck just happened and trying to get back to their homes and trying to figure out the mystery of why Japan just got fucking blown into oblivion. <clears throat> it's a uh, very, very dark series. Um, people get killed in it left and right. It's really, really intense. Um, there's a lot of dark themes in it. I do highly recommend it, though, because it is very, very well done in terms of storytelling. It reminds me a lot of um, <coughs> of uh, Uzumaki, that horror series, Gyo, stuff like that. A lot of uh, series by that author. It's an incredibly well done series. I would not recommend watching the movie, because the movie's kind of eh. But uh, the manga series is amazing. It's not a long read either. I think it's like at seven or so volumes or something like that. And uh, it has a lot of psychological horror in it. It has a lot of um, a, a lot of character depth in it. You really start to get to know the characters. Although at the same time, <clears throat> it's one of those weird series where you learn a lot about the characters, but you don't you don't learn a lot about them at all. It's it's hard to describe. It's a hard to describe series in general, which is what makes this review hard, but it is a very good series. So on that note, I do highly recommend you check it out. Um, it is probably somewhat not safe for work, but not that bad, if I remember. But uh, it's called Dragonhead, and again, highly recommend you check it out. If you like, you know, post-apocalyptic destruction terrible future dark horror stuff everything else like that it will be right up your alley because it's fucking amazing so yeah